There was a show recently that said that William Shakespeare not only taught us how to write, but taught us how to think. And as I do several poems here on uh, human conflict, I thought maybe there would be none better to start with than this brief passage from Henry V. Once more under the breach, dear friends, once more I'll close the wall up with our English dead. In peace there's nothing so becomes a man as modest stillness and humility. But when the blast of war blows in our ears, then imitate the action of the tiger. Stiffen the sinews, summon up the blood, disguise fair nature with hard favored rage, then lend the eye a terrible aspect. Let it pry through the portage of the head like the brass cannon. Let the brow overwhelm it as fearfully as doth a galled rock overhang and jutty his confounded base, swilled with the wild and wastrel ocean. Now set the teeth and stretch the nostrils wide, hold hard the breath, and bring, bend up every spirit to his full height. On, on, you noblest English, whose blood is fet from fathers of war proof, fathers that, like so many Alexanders, have in these parts from morn till even fought, and sheathe their swords for lack of argument. Dishonor not your mothers. Now attest that those whom you call fathers did beget you. Be copy now to men of grosser blood and teach them how to war. William Shakespeare from the prologue, Act Three, Henry V. 